Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us in here, out there, in the real world, in live space, and also on the internet. It is such a pleasure to have Ben Rosenblum and his trio here from New York City. I mean, I guess that's where Ben's from. Uh, a reminder uh, that if you would like to support these musicians, please consider throwing some money into one of the digital tip jars on screen. Uh, all of them, including Left Door, will go directly to the musicians. If you would like to support this music to help this music stay alive in these crazy times, that is a great way to do it. But a free way to do it is to smash that share button, send the links around, tag someone in the comments you know might dig these tunes. Uh, it really helps with the visibility of this incredible music from Ben Rosenblum. Ben, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing great. I mean, it's just such a pleasure to get to perform for such a beautiful audience here and uh, around the world, really. I see my friend from Japan in, so, you know, yeah. really international audience there. Hi, Kazutoshi. Hi, Remy. Wonderful to see you. Uh, so how's the tour been so far? Uh, tour's been good. We uh, were just in Yakima yesterday and uh, going to the Oregon coast tomorrow, but uh, really happy we could uh, put this together, and uh, it's a pleasure to be at the 1905. Absolutely, and if you wanted to see any of those future tour dates, would there be a website, perhaps at Ben Rosenblum? Oh, www.benrosenblummusic.com. And we will put that in the chat so you can check it out. Uh, you want to play another tune? Absolutely. I, I guess ask? I'll say the first song was oh, a yes. song by Wes Montgomery called S.O.S. Maybe appropriate for last year. I, I think we're coming <laughs> out of it now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but uh, great tune nonetheless. Uh, always great to dig into Wes's catalog. And uh, we're going to continue on with our version of a musical theater tune that we put a little jazz spin on. This is from the musical Ragtime, and it's called Make Them Hear You. Awesome. Ben Rosenblum Trio coming at you live from the 1905.
Yeah, you are listening to the Ben Rosenblum Trio coming at you live from the 1905. That's Ben Rosenblum on piano, Greg Feingold on bass, Ben Zweig on drums. Thank you so much for joining us. As you can see, there are actually uh, people in this room, which is very exciting. This is a new development here at the 1905. Uh, and so if you are interested, please consider contacting the 1905. It is very limited seating indoors, but uh, it is absolutely a possibility to get indoors in front of live actual musicians. Um, so uh, we are closed Mondays and Tuesdays, but uh, please check in Wednesday through Sunday, 4 p.m. onwards. The patio is open, um, and there's also limited seating inside. Ben, what do we got coming up next? All right. Well, uh, first of all, I just have to thank everyone in the audience. I'm seeing some wonderful people. I, I probably won't be able to get to everyone, but all of you uh, who are part of the family and friends who have tuned in, uh, Thank you so much, and so wonderful to see you. And anyone who uh, is seeing me for the first time, welcome. I'm so happy that you chose to tune in, and I really uh, appreciate it and hope to one day meet you all in person. So thank you all so much for uh, so many kind words here. They're not seeing it. Uh, <laughs> Kayla says, so good to see the three of you together. So <laughs> in any case, uh, that last one was... Uh, also from the West Montgomery book, strangely enough, but that was by uh, Sam Jones, a great bass player tune. It's called Unit 7. And we're going to continue on with an accordion tune, and we're actually going to invite a special guest up and do this Brazilian uh, tune. Uh, this is uh, from a style of music uh, in between choro and samba, and uh, I have a very close friend and amazing musician in New York City, who plays saxophone and bass clarinet named Jasper Dutz. And uh, our last CD that I have here, he is on. But uh, his father is an amazing percussionist, and this is my first time getting to play with him. So uh, welcome to the stage, Brad Dutz on the Pandero. And we're going to continue on. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to continue on with this uh, Brazilian tune entitled Receita de Samba, which means the recipe for samba. And it's by Jacob do Bandalim, one of the masters of Shoro. And a reminder to hit that share button. It really helps with the visibility of this incredible music from the Ben Rosenblum Trio. Thank you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, the Ben Rosenblum Trio featuring Jasper's dad. <laughs> that was killer. Brad Toots, everyone. Yeah. Such a pleasure. Wow. <laughs> Definitely uh, going to bring you up for one more later on if you're down. <laughs> amazing, amazing. Oh. Well, we're going to continue on with... Uh, one more, uh, one more accordion, accordion number, and uh, this one is uh, from the Ireland, Scotland kind of area. It's not a traditional tune, uh, and I'm hoping not to embarrass myself in front of an uh, expert of Irish music. But uh, this, this is a song that is originally credited to Peter Bellamy, and uh, it's. Uh, arrangement that I borrowed from a great Willen pipe player. It's like a kind of Irish bagpipe, and his name's Yarlath Henderson. The song's called Sweet Lemony. We hope you enjoy.
Ladies and gentlemen, the Ben Rosenblum Trio coming at you live from the 1905. A reminder that if you would like to support these incredible musicians and this incredible music, please consider throwing some dollars into one of the digital tip jars in the lower left-hand corner of your screen. It goes directly to the musicians, and it is literally how we are surviving these crazy times. If you are enjoying this music, please consider supporting this music. Uh, what do we got coming up next, Ben? I think we're going to go on to a Wayne Shorter composition that we used to play a lot. It's one that... Uh, I recorded on my second record, which features the wonderful Ben Swig over there. We haven't played this in a while, though, and I'm feeling it. This is called Seeds of Sin.
Ladies and gentlemen, the Benjamin Lo Rosenblum trio coming at you live from the 1905. Uh, you are hearing actual applause because they are actual live humans inside the space. It is very exciting. Um, so a reminder that the 1905 is open from Wednesday to Sunday, 4 p.m. onwards. There is music many of those days. Please check the schedule. But if you would like to come and be one of those people inside in front of the musicians, uh, there is limited seating. Please reach out to the 1905. But also come to the patio, uh, buy a drink, buy a pizza, help support this incredible place. Uh, and uh, also, if you would like to support these incredible musicians, the donation links are on the screen. It goes directly to the musicians. It makes a big difference in their lives. It is how we are surviving these crazy times. So if you're enjoying this music, please consider throwing some dollars into the digital tip jars. Ben, uh, what do we got coming up next? It looks like some exciting things are happening on stage. Oh, yeah. We're bringing Brad Dudes yeah, back to the stage. that's right. Yeah. The one and only. My goodness. I just want to say a huge thanks one more time to everyone joining. I see a lot of friends in the audience, some people that are from back home and my friend group. Thank you, Kim. Thank you, Rodrigo. Thanks, Anne. So many of you. So, so many. Thank you. Beto, JQ, Don. Really appreciate it. Also, some friends from here. Chris Brown's in the chat. Yeah. He sends his best. <laughs> he says, sounds good, Ben Swag. Yeah, man. Ooh, we miss you, man. Uh, hope, to, hope to see you next time we're around. Thank you so much for listening. And thank you to all of you that I don't know. Lee and uh, Rachel and Brian. So many uh, beautiful people. Monkey Man here. I like that one. <laughs> Monkey Man is a <laughs> Monkey Man is a regular of the oh, 1905 the stream. He's a great guy. <laughs> really, is such a pleasure to be able to play music for all of you. Uh, and uh, that last one was a little medley of ballads. First, a ballad by Mr. Frank Kimbrough, one of my main mentors uh, in my college years, an incredible pianist who sadly passed recently. That was called Beginning. And we went into a ballad that I first heard. It's by Arthur Herzog, and uh, it's one of the standards. But it's a beautiful ballad that I first learned off a of Billie Holiday record. It's called Some Other Spring. And uh, we're going to go on to another Brazilian song. And it's going to be uh, Samba. And it's from one of the most famous movies based around the Brazilian culture, it's funny that it's actually a French movie, and I think it's more famous in the Western world than it is in Brazil. But of course, everyone in Brazil knows a lot of the songs like Felicidade and uh, Mania de Carnival. I'm talking about Black Orpheus. Mm -hmm. But we're going to play one of the lesser known ones that actually features accordion on the soundtrack. This one's called O Nosso Amor, Our Love. The Benjamin Rosenblum Trio from live from the 1905.
Jasper's dad, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, Brad Tooth. <laughs> Brad Tooth. <laughs> one more, one more. All right. <laughs> Guys, if you like fancy tambourine playing, throw some money in a chip jar for crying out loud.
Brad Dietz on percussion, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much, Mr. Brad Dutz on percussion. Doing overtime up here, so I really <laughs> appreciate it. It's, but it's just such a pleasure to get to play with you finally. Really, oh man, what a beautiful touch. Oh man, all right. Thank you all so much for being here in person. It's such a pleasure getting to play this music for you and all of you online. Uh, oh man, it's just such a pleasure. God, I sound like a broken record, but really uh, every opportunity we have, uh, especially after such a crazy year and a half to play live music for people, it just reminds us why we stay in this music, why we keep doing what we're doing and uh, why we love to travel and meet people who support this music and love the music the way we do. So huge thanks to all of you and everywhere where you are around the world, huge thanks for joining. Beautiful, that last song was uh, called Choro Esperanza, appropriately for what I just said, the Choro of Hope. And we're gonna continue on with an original composition that uh, is the opposite in every way of what we just played. <laughs> This one, uh, if there are any uh, nerdy fans online or in person, it's a Dungeons and Dragons reference. It's called Chaotic Good. <laughs> and uh, it's an original composition that I was inspired to write, um, trying to emulate some of the work of Oscar Peterson, some of the more technical stuff. So uh, we hope you enjoy this one, Chaotic Good. Ben Rosenblum Trio coming at you live from the 1905. Ben on Ben Rosenblum on piano, Greg Feingold on bass, Ben Zweig on drums. Coming at you.
Man, I think that was a running baseline, <laughs> let alone walking. <laughs> Jesus, that was moving. <laughs> what do we got coming up next, man? Thanks so much. I think I'm going to give this guys a break after that. Uh, <laughs> by the way, how about it for Mr. Ben Zweig on the yeah. drums? Yeah. Yeah. And our good friend, Mr. Greg Feingold on the bass. Two of my best friends in the world. I'm so lucky that I get to travel with them and perform with them. So uh, thank you, guys. I'm going to do a short solo piano number. And uh, hope you enjoy this. I'm going to, going to slow things down a little bit and play a jazz ballad that I think uh, most of you will recognize. Hope you enjoy.
Benjamin Rosenblum coming at you live from the 1905. That was beautiful, man. Thanks so much. Do one more quick one solo before bringing the band back up. And uh, this one's a little stride number. We're going to go back a little bit a ways uh, and play this beautiful song by maybe the greatest jazz musician, certainly one of the most influential, Mr. Louis Armstrong. This is called Weather Bird. Felt like there was a little list on the back end of that. <laughs> you know, uh, they do it as a duet with uh, Earl Hines on piano, and he goes there, man. Yeah, Those yeah. cats, they, they, they were really hip, man. And you know what? Back then, they were uh, contemporaneous with some of the really great classical musicians. Sure. You know, not to go on a you know little nerdy rant <laughs> right now, but you know. Stravinsky wrote for Benny Goodman's orchestra. Yeah. You know, they were yeah, all yeah, yeah, they sure. were all back sure, and sure, forth. Sure. They were they were in there, and uh, yeah, you know, I think uh, one of the great pianists, Arthur Rubinstein, mm. allegedly or you know according to the myth, said that Art Tatum was the greatest pianist that he had ever <laughs> heard or met. You nice. know, too good a story not to believe. <laughs> <laughs> that's the story. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows if it's true? But that's 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 what someone told someone who told me. <laughs> You're out, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> so uh, thanks so much for joining. We have a few more for you, and uh, 
I think we're going to bring it to a place that, uh, well, when we walked in here, there was a great song playing. And uh, it's the great Nina Simone singing a song by Dr. Billy Taylor. And that song is, I wish I knew how it would feel to be free. So we're going to play that for you. You know, it's one of my favorite songs to play, but I hadn't been thinking about playing it until we heard it when we walked in. And man, hope you enjoy this one. And I guess I should mention, I know uh, Moses back there has been doing a great job of uh, mentioning that uh, there's, of course, lots of ways to support the club. But I guess I'll mention as well and take this opportunity to really give thanks to Aaron and to Moses and everyone here at the 1905 for hosting us, especially during this time. It really means the world to us for you to have us here right now. And if you want to help support this incredible club, you can, uh, help, you can donate to the 1905 and support their mission and help them bring in uh, great musicians like they always have, you know. They, they, they really make a point of not only supporting the incredible musicians in this community, but bringing in people from all over the country. And so, yeah, we're, we're really honored to be here and uh, definitely 